Dave, let me show you a couple more things. Um, when you want to take bills out of the machine, you have to go to the bill validator, which is inside the bed, looking from the back of the machine. This is the door from the inside. So this is your where you'll do all your service work, right there. Um, when you want to take your money out, you just put your hand around the, the back of the bill acceptor, and this is the bill box. Just put your hand around and then reach back and push that blue button right there. Push for push out and then lift up and the box comes right off. And what you want to do, this little door here, you open up. See if I can do this here. Open up and then your bills will be in there. And when you take the bills out, be careful that there's a plate back there that uh, gets pushed in when the bills get filled up. Make sure that that's not, these springs are straight, not cocked. Because if they're cocked, then um, it's not going to accept any more bills. When you take your bills out and you're done, just put it back and there's little latches, like that latch right there goes, just go a little bit above and just above that and then drop down and it's locked and then you're good to go. And you should have a solid red light right down here. There should be a solid red light. I don't have the power on now, so there's not. And then your coin mech is down below, right here. When you want to uh, add coin or take, <coughs> oh, excuse me, <coughs> when you want to take coin out or whatever, um, basically when you want to add coin, you want to slide this tray out. It's, it's on two um, rails. Always be careful when you do this because it's kind of flimsy and there's ball bearings in there. So you got to always be careful. Like don't let the door catch, catch it and uh, with this out. Just be careful, just grab it here, and it comes out in a drawer. Um, and then with the door open, I can't go anymore because I have my forklifts on the other side. But uh, that's the front. Um, you should have a red light here and a yellow light. That's when everything's working good. If one of them's flashing, you have a problem. Um, when I, If I'm talking to you and I say check the cassette, your cassette is right here. You can add um, your, this will actually come out. It comes right out and then slides in. But once you add your coin, um, you'll add your coin through up here. And I'll show you that when the machine comes, we'll go over that. Um, you go in the fill mode and then you just one at a time drop your coin in to fill these up. Your dollar, your nickel, your quarters, your dimes, and your quarters. Um, there's a row for each one. And then I also want to show you up here, this will be your cheat sheet. Um, when I tell you to fill coins, you want to go around the front and hit number one. Um, once you hit the service mode, and the service mode is right there. When I tell you to check the service mode, it's that blue button. You hit that blue button, it's going to beep. And um, when it beeps, It'll take you over to, I think it says 19D on this machine. Um, and then you go hit one for tube fill. Um, and then here's all your other options that um, I'll, I'll get you familiar with when the machine, machine arrives. Um, there's your pricing right there, number five. Um, there's your options. You can do, uh, let's see. Really, there's uh, POS. You don't have to really worry about any of this stuff for now. Um, but there's there's all your menus, and that's how you do your accounting number six, and it tells you right here. So this is basically your cheat sheet. And then also, I showed you that screen on a different video. Down here is your filter, and I'm going to put in. Um, I'll put in. I have two other filters for this machine, and I'll put them in for you. Um, so. Uh, just periodically check that filter once it gets dirty just put another one in that's real real important um, but that's where the filter is right right there and it just slides right out there should be an arrow telling you which way to put it in okay
and that's it for that. Now here's your power switch. Right there's on, off. So that's it. Uh, all right, thanks. Bye.